think being a scientist on an exploration mission. I'm being the last one left alive. Kind of crazy. There were two seats in the pod. I, I don't understand why no one else came. What happened on the Aurora? No idea. I think the computer's saying the air is good to breathe, but... I don't know if I want to go out quite yet. This place is kind of filling up with smoke, though. Let's see what's in here. Got a knife. It'll come in handy, probably. Battery, power cell. It's like some metal of some kind. Huh. It's a nice looking knife. Lightweight. Feels sturdy though. Okay. Let's head up. Sheesh. Last time I saw the Aurora was when I was getting on it. I don't really think the, the gravity of the situation's really hit me yet about what's happening. No land in sight. Nice fresh air though. A lot cleaner than Earth. Computer's saying the fabricators scanned the environment. Let's go see if I can use any of it. Hold on. Wait a minute. The med kit and the MREs are gone. Wonder if somebody just didn't stock this pot or something. I, that's weird. Well, that being said, let's take a look at the fabricator. Let's see what it's been able to find. Looks like we've got access to some good building materials, different metals. I'm gonna have to find this stuff. Some clean water requires bleach. I'm guessing the water outside's probably not safe to drink. What does it take to make bleach? Salt deposit and some of the coral from this planet. Well, gonna need water soon, so let's go see if we can find some. Here we go. Never really did like swimming much, but... It's like some local fish. I don't dare get near any of them or touch any of them. What is that? Stay away from now. Jeez. These fish don't look too hostile, but... I'm gonna have to get a scanner. The computer will be able to tell if they're hostile or not just based on their, their genetic makeup. Some salvage from the Aurora. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Some copper ore. Okay. Well, maybe we'll be able to use some of these supplies. Let's head back in and see what we can do with them. Okay. Yep, can s use that salvage from the wreck. Might be able to use this titanium for something else. Let's take a look and see um, what we can build the scanner with. Needs a battery. I think we have one of those. This is good. Let's go ahead and get that scanner built. Okay. Used one of these on the Aurora all the time. Should be able to scan some life forms, different minerals and things. Looks like I could build some glass. I'm not very good at holding my breath, so I'm gonna build a tank, hold some oxygen. Some fins would help. Silicone rubber. I think I needed some of the quartz, and I'm out of that, so let's go see if we can find some more. Scan some fish. 
Haven't eaten in a couple of days now. Jeez, that's what it feels like anyway. Hey, we needed some coral, didn't we? Pick some of this up. Make bleach. There's a fish. Fast little thing, though. The scanner has to get kind of close to get a full reading on it. Let's see what it says. Gary fish. Camouflage. Doesn't look like it's aggressive. Not as edible as it looks, says the computer. Must not have a lot of meat on it. Ooh, what's that thing? Let's go take a look. This thing is fast. There's another one. Let's see if we can get the rest of the information on it. Okay. Let's go up to the surface. Just run out of air in my tank. Let's take a look at it. Beeper. Big eye. Edible and substantial. Yeah, it's fast. But if I could scan it, I could catch it. Let's see if we can grab this one. Oh, they are fast. I got it. Other. And another. Nice. Saw something down there. Oh, more quartz. Need that. What's that thing, though? Attention. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. Okay, it's shuttle bug. Computer says it's not harmful. Just a bottom feeder. Okay, we'll grab some more quartz. We'll come back and take a look to see what that is. It looks like a data vault from the Aurora. Takes a while to scan. Seamoth fragment scanned. Looks like we've only found one out of five though. We'll keep our eyes out for those. The fabricator doesn't have a complete database. These vaults were from the Aurora and they... What is that? It did not look very friendly. I'm gonna stay away from that thing. Some mushrooms. Wonder if these will be worth anything. It's starting to get dark. Sheesh. It's got a quick day and night cycle. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Let's take a look and see what those mushrooms are worth. It's inedible. Looks like I might be able to make batteries with the acid from it. Pick a couple more. Wow, it's getting dark. There's a new fish. Let's see what that thing is. Boomerang. 
not dangerous. Edible as well. Let's go catch one. Fish seem more dormant at night time. another type of coral. Hopefully one of those will be good for making bleach so that we can disinfect some water. Let's head back and see what we got. Oh, I'm starving. Never eaten anything like this before in my life, though. Fabricator says that it cooks them, takes out their bones and organs. Ugh. Okay. Here we go. Vital signs stabilizing. Well, that was disgusting, but I'm afraid I'm going to have to get used to it. Okay, let's process some of this wreckage. Get some titanium. I wouldn't mind a second tank. I'm going to build some fins. Tank would need a titanium and glass. Fins, I don't really remember. There's a second tank. Would be helpful. Fins, oh, two silicone rubber. Get another one. Okay, there we go. Hopefully that'll help me swim just a little bit quicker. And... I don't really want to cook the rest of this fish yet. I'll hold on to it till I'm hungry again. And let's see what we have in here. It's pretty dark out there. I wonder what it's going to take to make a flashlight. Need another battery. What do we need to make a battery? Oh, we have some. Looks like it used those mushrooms and some copper ore. And it needs some silicone rubber, which took quartz. Now, let's see. Don't have anything in there that'll work. I'm gonna put this stuff away for right now. Head back out. We need some quartz, some copper ore, and we'll keep that fish for when I get hungry again. Let's 
see what we can find. Sure, it's pretty. Sunlight, we don't have anything like this on Earth anymore. I've seen pictures, but never really been there before. There's some more quartz. Gotta keep my eye out for those big fish. I didn't look very friendly. There's one. Jeez. I don't know what to do about those guys. What is this? Salt. Yes. Been looking for that. Some more copper ore. Some silver ore. There was one of those in the, the life pod. It says it's used for computer chips. I'll have to hold on to that. Some more quartz. What was that? They're chasing that other fish. Wonder what these are. Hard to scan. Stay away from now. I don't know what they are. Okay. Catch this guy while we're here. Oh, never mind. Let's see what they are. Bleeder. Kind of like a tick. Inconvenient and unhygienic. And eh, we'll still stay away from him. Okay. Let's see what else we can find. It gets pretty deep. I think I'm quite ready to go out that far from the pod yet. There's another piece of quartz. It's some metal. some more water here soon. We'll grab this guy. They definitely are more active during the day. If ever I need to go hunting for these fish for food, I'll just have to do it at night. There's a tube. Nothing in it. Okay. Oh, well, there's some more quartz in there. Pick this up. Go fill up the tanks and then We'll head in there. Man, I wish I had that flashlight. Okay. Let's go see what we can find. Looks like I might be able to scan that. We'll scan it in a second. Some more quartz. Wait, what is that? Looks friendly enough. Let's see what it is. Cave fish, huh? Hmm, says it's edible. Well, let's grab one. There he went. Caution. Continued degradation of the Aurora's dry core may cause a quantum detonation. Calculating risk assessment, death by malnourishment, 7%. By physical injury, 11%. By exposure to radioactive crash site materials, 19%. If the drive core is breached, probability of death increases to 65%. Sounds like the dark matter core has seen better days. Is that back in there? Huh. Yeah, let's try scanning this thing. And 
that. Picked up some more silver ore. Wow, it's getting dark in here. Oh. How is he in here? I don't care. Yeah, I better not go in there anymore. Pick this up. Some gold. Huh. Not sure what good that's gonna do me, but... Let's head up. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay. Go ahead and head back to the pod. Glad I saw that big fish in that cave before he found me. Let's go ahead and process these materials that we picked up. New creature discovered. And I I don't think I need to cook any of these yet. Um, let's take a look, see what we have here. Yeah, we'll probably hold on to those fish for right now. But I think I've got everything that I need. Let's grab a couple of those mushrooms so we can get a battery. I remember the builder needed a computer chip. Table coral sample. I actually think I picked one of those up. There they are. Probably don't need to, but that's okay. Let's see. Yeah. yeah I'll make a computer chip. The builder will allow me to set up a base that is just a little bit bigger than this pod and doesn't have any smoke in it. So we'll build that real quick. And the flashlight needs some silicone rubber. Picked up enough quartz for that. And now when it gets dark on me, which happens pretty quickly here, I'll be able to use this flashlight. Okay. Let's see. Flashlight's good. Let's go ahead and assign those a number. Try cooking this whole fish and see how much nutritional value it has. 21 and 3. Yeah, that'll do for now. We'll hold on to those to when we need them. And I might as well just process that metal that I picked up. Okay, that's done. We'll hold on to that stuff till I need it. And yeah, everything's looking good. Let's go ahead and check out this flashlight. Huh, nice. On, off. Good. Looks like Oh, yep, it does use energy. Saw a little meter there, it went down to 99. Let's make sure we don't run out of batteries in the middle of the night. That was a cool shadow saw there. The flashlight out. There's the builder. Okay. Yeah, so here's all of the, the building things. Looks like you may start with the foundation. Hatch needs some glass. Power? Nice. Can build a solar panel. Don't really know what that does. Okay, so we need to gather a few more materials and be able to get a base going. Let's go ahead and get as much glass as we can. Okay, what's in here? Waterproof locker. Beacon, mobile vehicle bay. Grab sphere. I don't think we need to mess with any of that right now. But with the dark matter core getting weaker by the second, we probably will need that radiation suit. Looks like we got a rebreather, some pipes, thermometer, and oh, flares. I don't really know what crash powder is, but the fabricators found some here. We'll have to keep our eye out for it. Okay. Let's 
that up. Looks like some birds of some kind. I don't think the scanner will reach that far. There's a planet off in the distance there. Okay. So we've got a few things that we need to gather before we can set up a little more permanent base. I'm going to keep my eye open to see if there's a good place to do so. I don't really dare get any deeper or get any closer to the aurora in fear. There's some more salt. I don't really want to mess with that radiation poisoning. I'm sure that it's going to cause some problems. Let's go ahead and use these coral samples and see if we can make some bleach. There we go. Kind of forgot about that a little bit. Okay, so we should be able to disinfect some water now. That's the filtered water, there we go. Might as well use those air sac fish to filter out water while they're still good. And let's take a look at it. There's the filtered water. Okay, so the disinfected water is twice the size. That's good. Let's go down and see what we can find. Don't see a lot right off. School of fish. Down in here is where I saw that nasty looking fish. Oh, there's some quartz. Wait, what kind of fish is that? real quick. Rabbit ray. Inedible but friendly. Okay, it has poisonous flesh, so I can't eat it. Alright, well, at least I know that it's friendly. There's that quartz. And there's some more quartz down here. Some metal. Inventory's probably getting full. Yep, yep, it's full. Let's take a look at it real quick. Okay, so I have three open slots. Let's break that. I was gonna scan it, but got a little carried away. <laughs> wow, it's getting dark already again. This wouldn't be a bad place to make a base. I don't see any hostiles. Sun's going down again. Day cycle and night cycle is a lot quicker here than what I'm used to. Well, I'm going to continue to record my progress here. I don't expect to find any survivors. The distress signal's not working. So, I don't really know what my future is here, but I'm going to try and survive and make the most of it.